Get off to that slow start, and, and, and we're still a turnstile on defense, and we have no identity, and there's the constant you know, musical chair lineups. The fans are going to turn fast. There's I, so many people who deserve to play. Yeah. There is no way everyone is going to be happy. Yeah. He, especially early. I think yeah. he's going to be wanting to please these guys, get everyone minutes. I just got it. Man, Fizz, please don't let me get to December and be seeing these. Can't play the musical like, channel. Lock in. If, if I like it or not, lock into something. Cause my... Yeah, because I've been getting there. Right? So now, now yeah. that we're talking about other guys, I I think it, it wouldn't be a bad idea to put Iggy in the, in the G League for a little while. Because I feel like the rotation is going to be so Wild. heavy. <laughs> yeah, yeah, man. You know what I mean? Especially yeah. at the three. Because you're going to have Knox and Morris getting the bulk of those minutes. Where is Iggy gonna gonna fit in? He would have to have a crazy preseason. To even, yeah, you know what I mean. Personally, I would like that, but Fizdale's kind of been anti G League. Yes, he's so down. scared about it. Is it no one? I'm trying to think. He's, yeah, he's outside, so he's of seen, two, outside of the two way players. Yeah. Yeah. Like you sent him down for a game. He did, yeah. did he do one game? Last and then bring, I think he. I think he sent him down for like a, a game. I think and he did. And then brought him back up. Send Dotson yeah. down. Yeah, so Fizz isn't game. a big G League guy. Because nah, right, one nah, thing, right. when Frank was getting those DMPs, I was like, Yo, just let him play. You can do both. You can do both. What was his name? Was who was it who did Plumley? Right, a couple years ago, he had the game and he ran over to the garden. Come at night. Yeah. So you could do both. Um. So I hope he uses it because I see Iggy. Iggy is a big doghouse candidate. He's a second round rookie. He's not going to complain. Frank is not going to complain. Doghouse. Mm. Dotson, even though he should, because he's earned it. Yes. Yeah, you know, and we're going to get to the two guard rotation, yeah, so I won't mm. go too crazy right, right, right now, but he's another one who may not complain too much. Yeah. So I, I don't know. Fizdale, he, Fizdale seems to me like he's going to give everyone minutes to start. I who's going to be in the suits? Oh, it's going to be a 14 man rotation. Who's, who's, who's going to be the team? It's going to be a 14 man rotation. You know, five minutes first. Well, wait, because it's 13 active, right? Hmm? It's third. It's fifteen on the it's active, fi- it's but, but two in suits. Yeah. Two's gonna be an active. Mm-hmm. Okay, okay. Mm-hmm. So we, yeah, we'll so, see. So who's, who's gonna be in the suit? Guys out. Who's gonna be in the suit? We pulling dudes. See, so he, see, that's he likes the to thing. Please. That's the thing with Fizz, right? right? He, yeah. He especially early. I think yeah. he's gonna be wanting to please these guys, get everyone minutes. I just got it, man. Fizz, please don't let me get to December and be seeing these. Can't play the musical channel. Like, lock in. If if I like it or not, lock into something. Because my big criticism of him last year. Was and look, we gotta give him, you know, respect for what that roster was. Yeah, we understand the situation. No one's no one's stating him just because the team was bad and the record was bad. But there's some inconsistencies with how he was planning things out, some of the system stuff, how the rotation was going. So I'm just some weird subs at crucial times right, where right, he like, right. pulled a guy for too long or left a guy in too long. Right, right. He had knocks on burner. He had knocks like knocks you playing every minute. Yeah. <laughs> so I want to see hopefully this year with the talent upgrade. More of a plan, and and I, I believe I believe in Fitz. I believe he knows this. I believe he knows a big season for him because yeah. if Fitz sucks this year, yeah. pressure's on, bro. Pressure's there. Yeah, pressure's I don't, on. I don't think he'll be. Yeah, the pressure's on. on yeah. So I got. I want to see some set. I want to see something that makes sense. I want to see him commit to it too and right. ride it out for a while, right. not just um five and games per ten. Now nah, I can't you do can that. Can't achieve. We had to have have tripled the league in terms of lineup changes last last year. Oh, yeah. oh my god, no doubt about it. I just felt like training camp was just like. <laughs> Never ended. It was yeah, just going yeah. through going. the season. Like. I think even Com- Commodore is like, oh, this is just like an extended training camp. Yeah. yeah. And it was like, oh, I think he, 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 he definitely said that. Yeah. He definitely, oh, this is like an extended talk, training man. camp. We're still trying to figure things yeah. out. I'm, uh, we'll see what happens. How much pressure do you think Fizz is on this year? Um, one, one, to ten. One, one, one to ten. One, one to him. ten. I, I feel like the organization is still kind of backing him, man. No, hundred percent. I don't I think. Mean, I don't think it's. A, I think the fans have the pressure on. So one to ten, I would say for him, five. I would go three. I think. I don't think. Perry mm. and Mills are worried. Right? They're not. Mm. I think, but I do think people like to talk about tanking. That was not the plan last year. It may yeah. have switched to like, oh, there's this full-out tank, but they mm. didn't come into last year talking about, oh, we're going to suck and get Zion. They were like trying to do something. We were 4-8 and eight at one point. Right. Then yeah. we were 13-48 and 48 right. at one right. point. Right. So right. There was, I remember we won that, that game. We were, we were all up there at um the pub, the Dallas game, mm. before mm. KP, before that, the early Dallas mm-hmm. game where we won in Dallas. Yeah, right? yeah. We were four and eight after that. That was game, a good game. Yeah, that was a good game. Yeah. Yeah. That was a good game. Yeah. I remember that game. That you look at us, everyone else. The, the enthusiasm was there. No one thought, "Oh, this is gonna get horrible." They were like, "Okay, young guys are playing. It's yeah. four and eight. We might get like thirty-two wins." Yeah. But it felt decent. So it kind of fell off the rails. Injuries, a bunch of stuff happened. But um, I think the year that we have this year is kind of what Perry was hoping for. Some of last year, last year, like yeah. he was hoping maybe for like a 28, 30 win season, right. and then you, you know that shows free agents what you got. Now you can take that leap. Mm-hmm. So maybe this year is it now. But yeah, Fizz, we can't win. To me, we can't win less than twenty-seven. Yeah, I said thirty. Like around, yeah, I said thirty. Kind of my ball. Yeah. I feel like thirty is my ball. Like, let's go. Let's yeah, go. Yeah. We, we, wow, if you got like twenty-three wins, man, I gotta. Yeah, I'm worried. Yeah. You got enough on this roster, especially regular season, where 
it's more about the depth, right? right. It's not really just super talent. It's like, yeah. can you keep running guys out there? Can you keep getting past injuries? Can you mm-hmm. keep the, the throat on the your foot on the throat of the other team? Mm-hmm. So if he's got enough here to make something happen. So if he makes nothing happen, that's the I thing. Mean, it's, yeah. it's 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 who you keeping happy. That's for that. <laughs> who is there going to be a December Enos cancer situation <laughs> when it comes down to it? Like we have uh, all these power. We got thirty seven power forwards on the team, yeah. uh, <laughs> right? Taz Gibson is here. He's supposed to be the guy, and then it's like, oh wait. It's there more. He, and there's more. Like, yeah, yeah. Nah, more is too. It's like, Morris. oh, where, Morris, where are my yeah. men is coming from? So, yeah. like, I, it's going to be interesting to see what he prioritizes. He has a tougher job in the NBA. Yeah, right yeah, now. Yeah. No yeah. doubt about it. Yeah, this, it's not going to be kumbaya. NBA, no. I've been telling people this. Everyone's yeah. so excited right now, right? And don't get me wrong. You should be. We got, like, a lot of interesting team. But the idea that these guys are going to hold hands and head to the playoffs together is, listen, mm. <laughs> you, you, there are fights that could definitely happen. Definitely, sure, literally sure. physical fights, and then yeah. they're just moody, emotional <laughs> quotes to the yeah, media. Yeah. You know, a little, oh, you know, I thought I was paying, but this, like, this, little things are going to start creeping mm-hmm. out because we got guys who they're coming. Everyone seems to be coming here, especially the new guys, looking like, oh, this my, this is me. Not like me alone, but like I'm in New York. Yeah, yeah. this is we my opportunity. This is yeah. yeah, they're all seeing minutes in their head. You just know how Bobby Portis is talking, right? Let's say Bobby, and Bobby can hit the shot, but let's mm-hmm. say his defense is just trash at the rim and Fizz mm-hmm. is like, I got to play Taj, a backup center. Yep. Mm-hmm. Bobby's not going to be all chill no. in January. Right, right. And he won't be, he may not be like outright disruptive, yeah. but there'll be a little, little murmurs. Listen, guys, yeah, these guys are de- literally they're on one year contracts. They, they they got, yeah, they got in trying to get their next they bag. They got to showcase and show and prove. Yep. Yeah. Uh, they're all on short contracts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and everybody's gonna be looking for their payday. Man. And I, I'm, yep. and I'm gonna say this: I feel like this, <laughs> like win or lose, I feel like this is gonna be. I feel like Fizdale. Mark my words. This will be the year where Fizdale gets the most shit. <laughs> yeah. Ever, because there's so many people who deserve to play. Yeah. There is no way everyone is going man. to be happy. Yeah. It's gonna be a lot. No, of it's, and, it's impossible. And the only way people will give Fizz like some crazy pass is if, like. We we like overachieve and get yeah. like forty five wins, mm-hmm. yeah. And like and the young guys play a go- bunch of minutes, right? <laughs> That's like the only way, yeah, that he's gonna how be I, void of of criticism. It's true. How I it's feel true. in terms of Fizz, like how I mean, I'm like how how he's how you should approach a season, Fizz. Mm. What I'm thinking is we're in you know we're gonna be October, November, December, right? If we are not making trades by February, I'm upset at Perry too. They have to well, dump yeah, some of these yeah, guys. Yeah, yeah. If, yeah, if they some of these guys gotta go, some of these finish, guys if they finish the off. season with these guys, right. I will be tight because right. we have guys that should be trade bait. Right. I think you got that whole Dotson Trier situation because, like, that, I don't yeah. think you're signing both of them. No, right. we're not. It, just, it doesn't it doesn't really make a lot of sense for <gasps> both, even though I like them. Damn, both. Doc, I, both. I can I'm see like, Doc like, going, yo. I love both, man. You know, we're gonna get to the two guard stuff. I keep bringing it up, but like. They kind of head in. It's kind of right. They're right at each other. Right, right. Mars. Yeah, Mars. Like he. That's why I could argue that he should be getting. Probably more minutes than not. So you could maybe, point. so you could maybe showcase him. Yeah, you, you might know, see because Dotson's deadline. at one million. So maybe you put him and Mars together. Sixteen million dollar yeah. package gets expiring back at a first pick. Right. That right, could right. listen. If I'm a playoff team and I got the, I could make it work. Morris and Dotson, so I give up a late, uh, mid late first. That's yeah. a decent return. So I want to see. You know, to my head, Fizdale got to really figure out what he wants kind of early. Not too yeah. early, but kind of figure out early because we to me, early. So we yeah. gotta get to January, February, and we gotta kind of know, know who, move. Mm-hmm. Yeah, mm-hmm. Who, who, who we're dangling out there as bait. Yeah, and I, 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 I'm not, and I love, I love my guy Ninja P, but I'm not so sure that's what he does. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like ah, if we're going off of tell. last season, what happened with like with Noah Vonleh? Yeah, and, and, and the year and before, some of these yeah. guys was on the bubble. Lee and Calo Quinn. Lee. That right. was the one because yeah, I genuinely Lee. was like, they were trades there, man. Both of them are overachieving. Like crazy that year. Right. Courtney Lee should have been there. None of them. Courtney Lee should have been yeah. there. It's like if we're going by the track record, he hasn't really pulled that trigger during that midseason. Yeah. Where when it was like when we had in that situation, like, okay, maybe we should get a piece here. And since we're not going to resign him, now if you thought about maybe he's going to resign Avon Lee or something, then maybe I can see why. But now nah, you didn't even. It didn't yeah. seem like you even offered him. They were like twentieth on that depth chart of point power forwards. Obviously because he signed twelve power forwards. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, look, I lo- and I'm happy Todd is here. No, I, I, I definitely mm-hmm. think he's good. I think he's gonna play back of center a lot. Yeah, me and too. I think, I think he'll be, I think he'll fill that DeAndre role. You, yeah, he'll yeah. fill yeah. out. I think he's going to well. be way I'm going to put yeah. this on record. I think Todd's going to be way better than people think. Yeah. People forget what winning and knowing the right rotation and playing defense means. Yeah, it means a lot. He can mean a lot. So it, True. But I would say, you know, Noah Vonley showed I mean, he kind of tailed off. But he did I show enough. He after showed right. a lot of He did show enough to me that like if we ended up in a tryout thing, could just kind of what happened. 
could have tossed him a one year deal again. I think I would. I, I, I wouldn't I, have been I can upset. Buy the argument. I, can I buy think the argument I, I like. I like Portishev then but finally, even been, though even though better, yeah, right. Got better I think Portis is still a better version, and I think <laughs> f- feel like Vonley he tailed off in the second half. Do you know what it is? You he know what it off. is? It's it's. I feel like Vonley has a higher ceiling than Portis, but Portis is better now. Like you know what Portis is going to give you right now. Knicks were last in shooting or like twenty seven. Shooting is a problem, and, and, and he's yeah. and he's yeah. top yeah. in the shooting now. Yeah. Beginning of the season, Vonley. Was hitting at a forty percent. He was killing three, it, right, right. and then took a nose dive towards the end. And but he also can play defense. He can also guard Giannis. He that was I love that as a Giannis. That's why right. he, he can also like, bring the ball up. Like, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. So like to me, he has such more of a complete game as a ceiling if he's given the chance that he has a higher ceiling than Portis. But you know, Portis is going to give you those three. The shooting, I think the shooting was just so bad. Yeah, Perry just was like, I got to get charge. Yeah, yeah, I mean, and, like, and he was a cheaper option. He was a che- yeah, yeah. I, I, compared to what compared else? Compared to know, what the else could have been out there. So I, I think it got there. to that point. Yeah, yeah. I get but, it. But to go back to this, you know, what trade deadline stuff. Yeah. You bring up Vonley. When I saw, you know, you saw him against Giannis, I'm like, yo, get this guy to a team that's going to be playing the Bucks in the playoffs. Right. Yeah. So I hope, I will say, he has had a bit of an itchy trigger finger at times. Mm. Which the Knicks kind of need at points because you know, all we've done for 20 years is have the most ready trigger finger ever. We got like an AK-47 of doing deals. We're like, yeah. what, are we, what can we do? Yeah, yeah. So at least, you know, having pragmatism is good. And I think it's it's helped us so far. But I do think we're getting to a point, you know, there's going to be a point. You got to strike in the NBA, man. See, Boston, they messed it up. They waited too long. Yeah. The asset, the cheese yeah. went bad. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> right? The asset started appreciating. Yeah, you got to time it. So to me... Yeah. You know, we got these one-year guys, and we, we pretty much said we're getting all the role players, right? None of you guys yep. get them. It's mine. So we got all these dudes. <laughs> all you, of them. You got teams out there Orcs. that got real championship aspirations that are looking for a piece. Man, I don't want pieces, Lakers, though. Clippers, etc. <laughs> the Warriors. You know, the Warriors might be interested Marcus in something. Marcus Mars, man. So Marcus these Mars guys, you be the guy. Yeah, listen, if, we, if, we're, be the if we're bad, like, or at least if we're not really good, we're hovering, and you can make a deal, make it. Because I don't want to yeah. see guys just expire, man. Mark, I don't want to see yeah. three, four, yeah. five guys guy. just expire, and that's it. And it's yeah. like, eh. I, I think, I think my rating from one to ten on Fizz pressure wise is going to be like a six, seven. I think, I think really? it's going to be. Quite you think a six bit. going in? Because okay. you think from Perry or just like general? I feel like it's more than fans. The, but, the but. garden responds to pressure, man. Yeah. And and you go into this with a nut seventeen with losses, wins was that was tough last year, bro. We did every fucking yeah, game. We did, yeah. man. We did every yeah. game. That yeah. was no, tough was to tough. go through. Even the West Coast. I saw the wins. April pie. It was like, oh, hey man. Hey guys. <laughs> hey guys. We're still here. <laughs> yeah. Um, <laughs> if you're still out there. It was, I think it was a basketball. <laughs> the Knicks game. just played a game. Yeah, yeah good uh, Joe JL, how you doing, man? You right? Uh, you right? Uh, how about that drink? Take the Zion. There's a lot of those. There's a lot of those, man. This is the thing. You talk about like just the mentality of fans. Right, Zion and the tank for Zion mm. and um, the free agency kind of got us through the last two months. It got it us through did. every definitely year, did. even even earlier, man. Like the last yeah. two months, especially when yeah. it got oh, real bad. Yeah. Yeah. Like that that thought was getting us through the lottery. Oh, yeah. The lottery anticipation always yeah. gets us yeah. through the end so of the second half. That's not. Sure. I mean, as much as you know, I'll be lottery hype will be there again. Like there was a thought, like oh yo, don't worry, man. The Knicks could be flip one eighty. Yeah, that was it. Soon. Yeah. Right. That's not gonna exist. Right. It's a slow, if we slow suck grind. and it's, it's a slow April, March, April, that so like you said, as much as I'm saying you know maybe Perry and Mills aren't on him, if the Garden's on him and the media's on him, yeah. that's gonna that's gonna leak that's up. Same because yeah. Yeah. you have to you have to think. The media's on the beat. Yeah. They're, they're on Nick's Twitter. <laughs> they're on Nick's yeah. Reddit. Listen, when when they they see what we're talking about, bro, they smell bad. And, and there's a lot bad. of fans even right now that are down on Fizdale. Yeah. So if we get off to that slow start and 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 we're still a turnstile on defense and we have no identity and there's the constant you know musical chair lineups, the fans are gonna turn fast. I, that's my opinion. No, nah, I, I still want to wait it's it true. out with them. I still want to wait it out with yeah, them because um, Macri had a good point on our show on the season preview last year. He said, you know, it's Fizz. The stepping stone. I was yeah. I've heard, heard that future. theory. That's my time. time. Or is that the future? The we don't. We don't know. Yeah. We don't know. Is is Fizz the guy? Is he Mark Jackson? For long long term. <laughs> yeah. Right. Yeah. Or is he Mark role? Jackson? Yeah, I said this. I always feel like where we were as a franchise. You got to understand the New York Knicks are such a unique franchise. What works for other teams and other cities is not going to work here. Mm. You can't just have. That's why I think, as much as I love Bud, and I think Bud would have got us more wins. I definitely, yeah. I would actually stand I by think, that. I Bud would have got Bud, us more wins, hundred percent. Van Gundy was my first choice, and Bud was my second choice. Mine too. There you go. Oh, but, yeah. but Bud, how would he have handled the media? 
How would you have handled right. the losing? Yeah. Right? How would, you know, I, and we, we have an image rebuild that we're trying to do. And Fizz mm-hmm. bringing in Will It's Reed, Patrick. <sighs> yeah. And having this, the personality he has, right. him with the media, I think we needed that to right. like, almost like wash us of our sins. Right. Of I get that, years. but the thing is But it's also, a point where you got to win. The thing yeah. is also is that Fizz has been getting called out for a lot of things, though. That's the thing. Like, yeah. A lot of the promises, a lot of the, 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 the no, he gets the, the reputation as a snake oil salesman. That's see, not I good. See. The car, the car, yeah, used that's car. Not the used car salesman. Yeah, man, I got not, this new movie, man. Good. Have you seen this yeah, new movie? Yeah, I got, right. I got him right over so the summer. So even though it, it, it feels like he can move, it's gonna catch up it's with gonna, him. Well, it will. I this was. Season, I'll, I'll, I'll see. Right. I'll, and I'll say this too: like he's he's definitely gonna need a time. We all knew. Like I mean, we saw half of the season. It's a tank season, right? But as far as like the media concerns and our look in the league, the one thing we have to remember is. If the Knicks fire Fizz this season, I which I don't think it, they will. Yeah, yeah. Talk about reputation hit. That's going to be a huge reputation hit if that ever happens because of what Fizz means to the NBA players. Mm. Personally, he's has connections with uh, of NBA players and no one other coaches don't have. People will come in here because I mean, of Fizz's personality. Didn't really help us in free agency. Didn't come <laughs> I mean, I, I, mean, know, I, mean, I feel you. I feel no, but even 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 get a meeting with I mean, the top guy. I mean, it, but that's that's you due know? to wins though, like. Yeah, yeah. If I still believe if we have the same amount of wins as the Nets last season, oh, I, we we get we we might get good. coach of the year, right? right. Yeah. That's, but yeah, but no, I agree with you because when he got let go from Memphis, players were riding for him. I'm just, I'm when he got, they were saying. like, "Yo, mm. this is messed up." Like, like people were tweeting, they were like, "This is really messed up." So I do agree with you that he has, you know, and it would kind of derail things, man. Be honest, it like, would. We've been it selling would. people would, on this guys is different. We got this three headed yeah, monster. Yeah. It, it, would, it would just look like it's more the it same. Would look like, same, yeah, same it would look like here's a revolving door, the next right, again. Right. Derek Fisher all over again, blah, blah, blah. So like, And he's so loved by the league that even Mario, Mario Hazonia didn't play, <laughs> and he was still happy. It's like, <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm going to be man. here. I'll play for exactly. free. Exactly. You know, I, 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 I he didn't love his play all the time, but Mario was dope as a Nick. He he, he got yeah. a great attitude the yeah, whole time. I like Mario. I, like I hope he succeeds in Portland. I came around on Mario. I came around on Yeah, so the only person he really pissed off was he has cancer. Is, yeah. 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 I mean, a leaf could piss off cancer, man. A leaf <laughs> goes the wrong way. You got something to say. He, listen, and his cancer is going to be in the, in the, I'm going to say WNBA. Sorry, I messed up. And his oh, cancer is going to be in the WWE oh, within yeah. five future. years. Yeah, oh, that's, that's, that's a That's his dream job. He's going to love it. He's going to be great. He's, he's perfect for it. That's factual. He's factuals. perfect factuals. for it. But, you know, Fizz got a, like you said, Fizz got a lot on his plate. Um, I think, you know, he's developing too, right? So yep. let's hope. Last year he learned a lot. Mm-hmm. And he can come in now with like, all right, guys, here's what it's going to be. I just want to see, like you said, I want to see that defense, the 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 same love he has for aggression. I think he loves the idea of aggression, mm-hmm. right? He sees a guy like Iso Zo just playing hard, right? Even if it's not smart, sometimes he loves it and he mm-hmm. values that. I want to see him take have that for defense. Need that on defense, and I want to see him that hold calling, guys man. accountable, man. That, yes, yeah. you know, yeah, to absolutely. this day, I'm upset about the Timmy thing on on um, Karis Levert, right? Because like you had you had you know Frank out there who's literally that's his calling card, yeah. And you know the Coach whole to win. The whole show us that you got I to win. win. I don't think that's gonna happen this season. I, I, I'm because, hoping because yeah. I keep going back to this one when he had that keeping it real moment when it was like, why do you play Tim Hardaway Jr. in so many minutes? And he looked <laughs> in the camera and was like, "We paying him, dog. <laughs> <laughs> we paying him. We paying him. How long after? Yo, was he trade like a month after that? Yeah. It was soon after the trade yeah. happened. Yeah. 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 It was like yeah. no other reason. It's like he's the worst defender on a team, <laughs> and he's guarding Levert, and he, he, yeah. he was like, he "Can't have it. I, It's a teachable moment. I'm, he's like. I don't think we're gonna have. More, I don't think we're gonna have as much as those. I'm hoping you teachable have moments. Teachable right? moments yeah. Yeah, in I hope game. So. Right. right. I hope so. Yeah. yeah. And keep him accountable. Listen, crazy thing about basketball, man. No matter how much the era change, you can stop people from scoring because it's a mentality. It's um, it like builds up in your head, right? Yeah. When our offense is going down and they having trouble, they second guess themselves. They're like overthinking things now. Mm-hmm. You get on the break. How many easy buckets you can get? You got runners now, right? You got. Mm. RJ's not that fast, but you got a guy like Dennis Smith who can sprint. Mm-hmm. Mitch might be the fastest center in the league, if mm-hmm. not close. Like, we got guys that can run. Randall can run the floor. Yeah. So I'm hoping, you know, the defense happens and we're getting easy buckets on the other easy end. Because right. yeah. I think we yeah. could struggle in half court. There's a chance we right. could struggle in half court. So let's exploit that speed, that youth, that athleticism yeah. that we got now. That's you know, the Knicks are never athletic, at least historically. Yeah. Look at us now. We got a... It's, if you look yeah. at a couple of years ago to now, man, the athleticism yeah, jump has been yeah. huge. Yeah, that was the whole. That was the whole. The whole goal. The yeah, whole Perry, goal Perry was. Yeah, that, right? he was yeah. like, 
Phil got things too slow here. Let me turn things around. We're going to get athletes in this. Because I remember, yeah. I still remember what game. I think we was playing the Memphis. Who was it? The Lakers, one of them. Because, thank, thanks. What's up, Randall? Randall was <laughs> killing us. <laughs> oh, <man>. Killing KP. <laughs> he was just killing. He was just outrunning us. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The, uh, was the, the Lakers game and the Memphis game a few seasons ago when I was just like, yo, we're just getting out athleted. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> yo, let's just coin that sure. phrase. I love it. <laughs> coin that. Let's get that sure. shirt. Out athlete. Oh, coming. Get Shows coming. Trust me. <laughs> Trust me. <laughs> but no, you're right. You hit it on the head. Yeah. Like we we have that. So to me, like play to your strengths, right? Um, the shooting's better this year, so you could use that. But to mm-hmm. me, yo, we got runners, man. I want to see yeah. get down, get out, run, shooting, run them off the run, court. Yeah. What, what was that movie? Uh, Coach Carter, right? Where he was like, going to run. Yeah. yeah, we can't do anything, so we're going to yeah, run. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> shout, yeah, shout out Sam. Yeah. <laughs> hey, what's the Ch- Channing Tatum was in that, right? Yeah, Young man. Channing Tatum. Oh man. <laughs> <laughs> 